So this is just a quick part explaining why when we were firing a projectile at the power up that it automatically gave us the power up. It's because we screwed up or I screwed up and uh, under drop power up I set the player power up equal to true. So we want to get rid of that in both the dead enemy as well as the um, wall being deleted. And then what we do is we go up all the way to player collides with pickup item. And what I just did is I just added this line of code right here, which um, if the power up equals true, then player power up equals true. So that actually makes sense. And if we, if it was a coin, then we would simply just add to our uh, gill count. So we could also do the same thing with um, pickup array counter dot um, under the item. Where is it? Pickup. We could say bool is nova power up. Go back to main dot is nova power up equals true. Then we're going to say that our normal power up is false and our nova power up is true. And we can make it so that when an enemy dies, we have a chance of dropping a Nova power up. We can make it a one in eight chance. And so we say is Nova power up equals true. And we will change, we have to add, um, this to this one because the object it saves everything so we'll say false false so is coin is false is power up is false and is nova power up true And then we're using um, the texture power up, but we want to actually access a different um, a different portion so that we have a different um, sprite image being drawn for it. So I think how we'll do that is under pickup, we can set the texture rect and under main, so we'll go pick up one dot sprite dot set texture rect, and we'll do the same thing for this one, but we will load in a different image. So for our Nova power up, how about we load in at 32 over? So let's see if that actually worked. We may need to also change the coin if that affected anything. But we did in fact fix the collisional thing. So we're not getting the power up just from simply hitting it. So now we should have a power up. There we go. Yeah. Okay. So there we go. We just picked up our Nova power up. So now if we run over the regular power up, it has our other one. And now we'll try and get the Nova again. So 
Sweet. So that's pretty cool. And I think in a future video, we'll actually just do something fun and maybe it's not fun, but it's cool making this stuff and uh, create some rooms that are connected together manually. And then we'll put some enemies in there, some uh, special crates in there and stuff like that just to make it sort of look more like a game without spawning in things randomly. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching. See you in the next video.